welcome to my channel. My name's Carla, if you didn't know. Probably didn't, but um, anyways, in the mail today, I got this big misguided package. I have feel like I haven't bought clothes in such a long time, so I felt the need to buy clothes. And also, Australia is coming up to summer soon. I don't even know if I bought summer clothes. I can't really remember. But I bought lots of stuff from the new in, so if you like what you see, you'll be able to buy it. So, yeah, I'm just... I'm excited to open it. So, um, let's just get straight into it. This is probably the biggest puzzle I've ever received in the mail because I don't really shop online that much. What the? Okay, so... Oh, I remember this. This is this is a, just a plain um, oversized grey t-shirt and I bought matching um, cycling shorts with it, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I'm really scared these are going to be see-through though because they feel like quite thin. Like they look really thin as well. But I'll have to try them on and see what they look like but they're a nice length. The shirt feels like a lot thicker than the bottoms. But this is just the shirt. Okay, so this is the set together. Um, I don't think they're meant to be together because they're like two different colours. I mean, I bought a set from Misguided like exactly like this, but it was black velvet and they went together. But I think I might have bought like the wrong ones or something because I'm pretty sure the pants are more expensive in the black one too. Like the pants are a really nice fit. I, re I really like the high waist and like, I don't think this style of clothing suits me. It kind of is like Yeezy vibes and I feel like it like suits curvy people a lot more because it just makes me look... A little bit weird maybe for like pajamas and look nice but I think that's about it I don't uh. oh, but it was cheap though I'll give it that these were like $12 oh no five and this was like 12 but the black it's kind of see-through the bottoms like you'd need to wear nude underwear like seamless and it would you'd be fine but like I don't know if I'm gonna keep it or not okay oh I think this is a bum bag actually what Wait, I don't think, I don't remember ordering this. I swear the one I ordered was like leather. Or like, not leather, but like, you know, fake leather. But this is still cute. But this is like, smells kind of weird. This is like furry, it looks like a sheep. I mean, it has like good compartments. It says I ordered it and it was 80, how much? $20, $20 down from 40. Okay, so this is the bum bag. I couldn't be bothered changing it to a different outfit. But I think this is how you're meant to wear it. I was going to wear it around um, my waist or whatever. But this is actually really cute. But the only thing I will say is that um, there's like, you can't really adjust it. There's only two different holes. So you can't really make it, like, if you want to wear it around your waist, I don't think you can, like, really tighten it that much. But it is cute. I probably will keep it, maybe. I don't know, I kind of feel like I'm wearing a sheep. But it is nicely made, so. And cute. Oh my gosh. This is so cute. It's like a diamante belt. Okay, this is so pretty. This will look so nice, like, dress, dressed up. Oh no! Wait. Oh wait. I was gonna say that it's broken because there's like missing diamantes as you can see there but I think that's just where the belt thing goes, the belt buckle. Oh yeah, I'm so excited to try this on, this will look so cute. Because I always am like wearing comfy clothes and like baggy shirts as you can see and like jumpers and stuff but like this will like make an outfit so dressy. Oh and this was like... Uh, $25 down from 50 so I mean it's kind of pricey but I mean it is like really detailed oh no okay I know this outfit does not suit the belt but um, I just grabbed the first shorts I could with uh, belt loops but this is like the tightest the belt is on and I'm not I don't even have like the skinniest waist or anything and it's way too big and this was like a one size like I guess I could move it like down but I'd have to make my own holes and I'm like kind of scared of wrecking it because it was kind of expensive 
but I love like the shine and whatever like I really don't want to send it back because it's so cute like it would be so cute with uh, with an outfit I reckon it would make an outfit look so nice like I actually love it not with this I mean this is kind of a whack, a whack outfit right now but oh oh no I really wanted I really wanted this to work okay and next we have a sleeveless cut out knitted bodysuit Oh my gosh, I was I was like really debating getting this because like bodysuits like is they're really hard to fit me because I'm really tall. I'm 5'9. Well not really tall, but like pretty tall. But this, oh my gosh, this feels so nice. Like the material of this is so nice. And I'm pretty sure it was like cheap. Yeah, this was $20, which is like it's not super cheap, but it's like good. Oh yes, I'm so excited to try this. Okay, so this is the bodysuit. I actually really like it. Like, it's so comfy. Believe it or not, I've never owned a bodysuit because I was just I was so scared they're going to be uncomfortable and not fit me because I'm too tall. But I also um, put the belt back on with this and I think it actually looks fine. Like, it doesn't look too big. It just is kind of more of an accessory. Oh, wait. Oh, my gosh. Um, the only thing with this um, bodysuit is this is the neck and I have no idea... Like, if, if this is how you're meant to, like, put it on, because it's really small, or maybe you have to have it... Oh, wait, that's fine. Oh, oh that looks so different. Ooh, I love this bodysuit, but I don't, I don't think it really suits this skirt, because the skirt looks a little too casual. This would look really nice with jeans, though. Yay, I'm so happy with this one. Well, I keep moving around. Sorry if that's a little bit annoying. I might have to buy bodysuits more often, yay. I love it, I love it. Okay, the next thing is a bandage, uh, bando mini dress. <gasps> Ooh. I do not have like any black dresses. I thought this would be like way thicker, but it's like, it's, I don't think it will be see-through, hopefully not. But it's like the midi length, I really like that. I think it looks really nice on like tall people. And this was only like $20, so that's really good for like a bandage dress. Okay, oh my gosh, I'm not even kidding. This dress was so hard to put on, like, no joke. It has no zipper or anything to be able to put it on. And it's like, the material isn't very stretchy, so I was like, oh, I'm like, I feel so stressed right now. I was feeling so claustrophobic trying to get this over my head, but, like, I couldn't get it over my head, and then I ended up having to pull it up, and it was just like, <sighs> so difficult. Okay, this is like the, probably the only angle where you can see the length of the dress, but this is the dress. Oh my gosh, this is, it actually looks quite nice, but it was the biggest struggle to put on, like I'm not even joking. And it, it doesn't really, it doesn't have that sticky stuff up there to keep this up here, so I mean like, if you like struggle with like, dresses falling down, that might be an issue. But this will be the only black dress I do have if I keep it, but I don't know if I'm going to keep it. I haven't found the perfect black dress yet. I don't think this is the perfect one, but it is quite nice. I really like the length though. Like, I think it's really nice. But I don't know. Okay, if you know me, I like really love wearing like oversized jumpers with like cute shoes or whatever, just like on a comfy day. Like, cause you know, sometimes you just can't be bothered putting together a full outfit and like oversized jumpers look really cute. But on tall people also, it's like kind of, it's really hard finding an oversized jumper that actually is like a dress, kind of, because most of the time they're way too short. But this one is actually designed to be a swim dress. Oh, this actually feels so nice as well. It's like quite nice in the middle. This is just a plain, it just looks like a sweater. And it's just black. And this one was only $18, so that's really good. <laughs> okay, so this is the jumper dress. The black one is kind of long, actually. I don't know if I like it. Like, I do like it, but it's kind of boring, you know? But, I mean, it is cute. I can wear it with, like, heaps of stuff. But it's just, like... It is really soft and comfy, though. But I don't know why I bought all these jumpers. Like, it's coming into summer. Like, it pretty much is already really hot. The arm length is a little bit short on me. But that's just because I'm tall. So... Oh, I got this t-shirt. Wait, I just realized like lots of this doesn't even look summery, but that's okay. This one is a t-shirt dress. Another simple outfit, as you can tell. Another one. 
And this one's $12. Oh, this is actually really cute. It says Leonardo on the front. Literally, all I could think of was, um, I don't know why, but I was just thinking of Titanic. Because <laughs> of, um, Leonardo DiCaprio, obviously. But I really, I like these colours. I think they look nice. Okay, this is the t-shirt dress. I think it's actually really cute. And it actually is really big. Like, look how big that is. And I'm tall as, like... If you're small, this is gonna be like ginormous on you. Like this is a size eight. Everything I've gotten is a size eight. So like this is the first time like I could probably size down and like you never hear that from me. But I mean like if you're like a size six or four normally, ee, good luck to you. This is gonna be really huge. But I think it's really cute. Like I could style it up nicely. I'm like, I mean this would even look cute. Like it's it's very casual. Like this, I mean, I mean, that looks kind of weird. Still cute. I still feel like this is pajamas though. Like I swear everything I've tried on is that either too nice or too pajama-like. At least I think I can work with this one. I'm not sure about the gray one. And I like what it says, you know. Feeling myself. Okay, the last thing I have is another jumper dress. Surprise, surprise. Oh, this is so nice. This is like a, wait, what is this? This is a high neck ribbed sweater and it's $22. And it's what, well, I don't really own anything white at all because I feel like it just doesn't suit me, but I really, really liked this, the style of this jumper. It's just high neck and oh, it looks kind of short though. Like it looks really short. Oh no, it looks short. Oh, I really wanted this to look nice. Oh, we'll see. Okay, and this is the last item. I thought this was gonna be way too short. I mean, it's not way too short, but it is a little bit short at the back. Like, I definitely need to wear something else underneath it. But it's actually so cute. I love the cut of it. I mean, I look a little bit pale to be wearing it right now, and it is really hot, so. But. It's, it feels so nice. Oh, oh wait. It's see-through. Yeah, definitely need to wear something at the back. Oh my god. Oh, I really don't know how to feel. This is, I feel, I'm, well, I do feel really, really hot. That's for one. I didn't really find anything that I, like, really, really love. But I mean, like, the quality and everything is really good. Like, I found that everything is like really good besides, like, the no zip on that dress. But, like, the quality was still nice of it. But, like, that's just could be a few things to improve but I'm not sure what I'm gonna keep and what I'm not I really did like the bodysuit though I thought that one was really nice but I really hope you enjoyed this video anyways please give it a like and subscribe if you're new probably are new but um yeah thank you for watching please leave your suggestions down below so I know what you'd like to see and uh, I'll see you next time bye